There's that field, number one, Big Green Machine, owned by Jay Ingram of Davenport, Iowa. Tex Mode Strange, Dale Heitman is in the bike. Two, Sporty Mr. Grace is scratch. Three, Radlin Ross, the 2002-year-old champion, owned by John Leahy, Anderson Racing, Inc., and John uh, Heliopoulos of Chicago, Joe Anderson Trains, Ryan Anderson behind Rattle and Ross. Four, Diamond Man, owned by Shirley Levin, by Vernon Shire Racing Stable, Brian Penske Stable, Penske Trains, and Drive Diamond Man. Five, Constant Change, owned by Benita Simmons, Hunt Harness Horses, Inc., by Helen Logan of Illinois and Kansas, Tom Simmons Trains, Tony Morgan is up. Six, Victory Sports, owned by David Brooks of Cambridge, Glenn Br uh, Brooks, the trainer, Brent Holland in the bike, and the number seven, Sports Dare, owned by Canamera Farms, LLC, of Felton, Delaware, Irvin Miller Trains, Andy Miller drives Sports Dare. Diamond Man with 75,000 earned already this year. Middle of that field. Now the gate picks up speed, six in behind, and here they come. We're often pacing between horses, constant change. First away inside him, Rattlin' Rock gets out second, third to the inside, big green machine. Four is Diamond Man, dropped in five is Victory Sports, Sports Dare at the back. Field of six around the turn, headed toward the quarter from the outside. Constant change takes com uh, command for Tony Morgan. He'll control the pace of this one now as he leads it by a length and a half. Constant change, the cold muffler cold and Morgan, and just momentarily because to the outside, to the front, goes quickly now, Rattle and Rock. He's past the quarter. He's onto the back stretch. Front panel in 26-3, Rattle and Rock takes command for Ryan Anderson. Second is Constant change. Third down the backside, big green machine. Four is Diamond Man yet to move from there. Five behind him is Victory Sport at the back. Sports there. And now on the outside, there's action as they approach the half. Underway, big green machine. He powers his way to the front, takes over before the half. Second now is Radlin Rock racing third as they reach the half-mile mark with three lead changes. It's constant change. The half and 55-2. They're headed to the draw gate. Now here comes Diamond Man. He's to the outside. Racing past. Pacers was fourth. Now third. Now second. Diamond Man in pursuit of the lead as they race now into the upper turn. The leader, Big Green Machine. That's Diamond Man pulling alongside. He's second by a neck. And behind him, following cover, Victory Sport has pace for Brent Holland. He's third on the outside. Fourth to the inside, needing racing room is constant change. And they're in a bunch, three in, three out. Four lengths separate them all the past three quarters. That marked 123-4. Nobody out of contention. Top of the lane, they turn for home. Diamond Man, by time on the outside, on the inside of him as they drive through the lane, is Big Green Machine, Diamond Man to the front. And now to the outside, coming on, Rattle and Rock. Here he comes, Rattle and Rock on fire. Diamond Man, Rattle and Rock, Diamond Man wins it. Rattlin' Rock was two, home three, Big Green Machine four, constant change, photo for five in 151. ...of the Illinois State Fair Colt Stakes with Diamond Man, his fifth win and his tenth try this year after winning the Maywood Pace. Owned by Shirley Levin, by Vernon Shire Racing Stable, by Brian Penske Stable, with Brian, the trainer driver, here's Diamond Man. Diamond Man, the striking colt with the color of his maternal family from a Broadway Express mare carrying the roan that a lot of the Broadway Expresses race with. A colt by Cole Muffler, bred by Brent Johnson. Now with the 151 score, just off his personal best of 150 and 4 fifths. There is the winner. Diamond Man, Penske's second of the afternoon.